chapter is a scammer in Nigeria. Many of you may have heard the recent Scambate Central upload where Mr. Pricky tried to send him some money and Mr. Pricky's wife got involved and it turned out that she was having an affair. I was recently in a group call with some friends and we decided just for fun completely spontaneously to call Victor. During the call I had an idea to have him speak with my wife's sister and who better than Mr. Scambate who was in the call with me at the time. I hope you'll enjoy this. Hello? Victor, how are you, my old friend? I told you not to call me again. Victor, come on, we're old friends. Let's work as men and get this done. You know I respect you. I do respect you, Victor. Okay. Sir, what do we do to get this done? I have told you I have told you what you have to do. I told you to send the, the, the remaining balance of seven hundred dollars. Sir, sir, we have to get this situation with my wife and the pastor. You know the pastor is f***ing my wife. And I don't know what to do about it. You are a man of the world. You are with United Nations. Tell me what to do. What do you want me to say? Give me some guidance. Some guidance. Is that the reason why you called me? No, no, no. We can get to business, but we have to get this matter with my wife first. So I know you can help me. Nothing concerning with your wife and your issue. If you want us to talk business, we talk business. This is business. You know, my wife, it was her money. I used her credit card. So it involves my wife. So how do I get my wife back on side, back into our marriage? Tell me, Victor. Mr. Pivi. Yes, sir. I think we should end this conversation now, since you don't have anything to say. Victor. Listen to me. Listen to me. Don't yes. involve me in your wife's issue, please. Sir, what do I do about this situation with the pastor and the bishop? Honestly, I don't know. I don't know. This issue you are involving me into, honestly, I don't like it. If your wife, you, as a man, you know what to do, okay? Listen, the issue here is not what I need to be talking up about your wife, going to pastor or whatever. Well, sir. What, listen to me. What let me know you is because of this transaction money again. If you are interested to receive your phone payment, then you have to follow my instruction. You have to send a balance so that you can get this thing done. Okay? Sir, the pastor said that I have not matured. He said, Pricky, you have not matured. This is why your wife is seeing another man. What could he mean by this, Victor? I don't understand. What could he mean? I don't know. I don't know either. Victor, you could take this to the United Nations for me and ask somebody there. Somebody will know how to deal with this sort of thing. Except you told me to email you with the bank account information to send the balance of $700. If not, consider your phone payment cancelled. Victor, all you want to talk about is my payment. I need you to help me with the wife and pastor matter. Oh, there is nothing I can do. There is nothing I can do. See, it sent to me that your wife come to me and he told you something I did not say. That is bullshit. I, I, I'm a man of my word. I'm a Christian. I'm sorry. Sir, I went to the pastor and he told me I have not matured. I went to the bishop and the bishop told me it is God's will. He said it is God's will, Pricky. Is your wife there? Her sister is here. Her sister. Speak with her sister. No. No, 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 no. I don't want to talk to anybody, please. Hello? Can I help you, sir? No. Sir? I said no. Give me the phone. Let me talk to him, please. My phone is on speaker, so we can both hear you, Victor. Please speak with my wife's sister. She does not approve of her behavior. Tell her your opinion. That's nothing to say, please. I want this food on you now. I'm very, very upset with you. My sister is very unhappy in her marriage. Do you have any advice for her? Mm, I don't have any advice. Are you sure? Because I know you're a man of the world, and I know that any kind of advice you could share with us would help the situation. That I don't want her to go through this alone, so is, if there's anything that you can share with us, 
we would appreciate it because I love my sister very much, but their marriage has some ups and downs sometimes. But as a man of the world, if you could share some information with us, we'd be so grateful to you. Oh, the only thing I can say, if the woman is tired of the marriage, the husband should go to court. Go to court. Why? Yeah. Because I think the sister don't want to marry Patrick again. Since she has decided to meet a outsider, according to Tricky, told me that he go for a pastor, and it's not good. It's not good. It's not good. <clears throat> Victor, can I share a secret with you? Okay, go ahead. I am really interested in my sister's husband. Should I tell her? Should I confess? Oh, uh, I can't really say it because I'm not in your mind. But for me, it's not good. It's abomination. It's not good. Uh, you fell in love with your sister husband. It's not good. In the sight of the God, it's not good. And this is just between us because I know we're not on speakerphone right now, so he can't hear us. But I have the wildest daydreams about him. And sometimes when I'm with my sister, she looks at me like she knows something is going on. But I really don't know if I should confess. Should I? Mm, so in that case, I uh, don't know. Have you explained your feelings to Mr. Fricky? Well, I'm not entirely sure I should tell him because... My sister's younger than I am, and I know that Mr. Pricky likes to go for older women. I just don't know what to do. How old are you? I'm 45. Oh, well, you're too young. Yes, I'm 52 years. Oh, so I'm too young for you? Yeah, you're too young. Are you sure? Yes. Are you married? Yes, I'm married with four kids. My first one is about 30 to 40 years now. How old is your wife? My wife is about 47 years. Yeah. 47? Yes, 47. Well, she's not much older than I am. <laughs> I meant to be with only one wife. Oh, you've only I'm... been married one time? Yes. Hmm. You never I'm looked married... at another woman? No, no, I don't have to do that. I don't have to teach on my wife. You're not allowed to look at other women? No, 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 not at all. I don't look to any other woman except my wife. Are you allowed to look at another man? No, she don't do that. No, no, have you been with another man? What? What, what do you say? You never looked at another man then, huh? Oh, my God. You mean uh, if I have been with another man? You're telling me that you're not allowed to look at another woman, but are you attracted to men? Oh, my God. What are you suggesting? Have you ever thought about it? I am a Christian. Okay, so before your wife, have you had a husband? You said what? What? Did you have a husband before you had your wife? Since I married my wife, I have not... Did you have a husband before you married your wife? Listen to me, listen to me. If this kind of a joke, I, I, I don't play for joke. I, I, I'm a matured man, okay? I'm not a kid. Have you been with a man? I, I don't like this. Folks, please do subscribe to Mr. Scambrate's channel and click the bell icon. Thank you.